Back, you know, it wouldn't be the Three Rivers Arts Festival without a little rain. Strong line of storms made its way through downtown Pittsburgh last night. Festival goers pulled up their umbrellas because, you know, they brought them and continued to walk around the Golden Triangle to enjoy the artist market, food and enjoy live music. This morning, there's some clouds out there, but that sun is peeking through and we are live at the Arts Festival to meet one of the artists who braved that storm last night. Selena Papiani joins us live from Point State Park. Hey, Selena. Hey Heather, good morning to you from Point State Park. You are absolutely right about that. But you know what? The rain did not stop the Pittsburghers and the out of towners from coming down and enjoying everything that the Dollar Bank Three Rivers Arts Festival has to offer, from the delicious food to the amazing music to the fabulous artwork. So as you know, we are here in Point State Park and the artist market doesn't open up until noon. But my good friend all the way from Marysville, Ohio, let's say hello to her, Jennifer Flo. Thank you. Thank you so much for chatting with us. You opened up your booth a little bit early for us. So tell us some of the artwork you have on display here for people to check out. Oh, thanks. Oh, thanks for coming down and thanks for asking. Um, my work is all vintage, layered, mixed media, um, acrylic paint, vintage pieces of sheet music, um, vintage fabric, hand painted papers, and then just really whimsical. I paint happy, I'm happy. And then people come in and they're drawn to it. They see something that's special to them and we become friends and there they go. Finds a new home. I love it. And I'm just such a happy person too. And I noticed you have so many positive quotes on each of your pieces. Mm -hmm. I've collected quotes um, you know, since high school, but you can always see too what kind of a mood I'm in or what maybe music I'm listening to. If it's jazz or the blues or uh, a little Jimmy Buffett, that'll find its way into the artwork too. Fabulous. And now you have been involved with the Arts Festival for seven years now, but I'm sure you've been involved all over the country with different festivals and events. What makes this so unique? You know what, I love, first of all, the Pittsburgh Cultural Trust puts on an amazing venue. They give us this beautiful space to come down and display our work. The artists are amazing. We're like a tribe down here. Some of us see each other. We haven't seen each other for a year, but we come back and we pick up right where we left off. And then of course, Pittsburgh is amazing. There's so many beautiful people and customers who are now friends. So they come back, they say, hi, buy something, don't buy something. I'm just glad to see you. Definitely, Jenny. And I know the artists will be rotating. So how long will you be here this week? Uh, the park and myself, we are here through Thursday and then Thursday night and then a new group comes in for the weekend. Mm -hmm. Well, we look forward to catching up with your work. Thank you so much, Jenny, for joining us today on Pittsburgh Today Live. And like we mentioned, the artists will be rotating. So if you come on down to the Arts Fest and if you see something that maybe catches your eye, I would get it before it is gone. Heather, we're going to send it back to you in the studio. But for now, we are live here at Point State Park at the Dollar Bank Three Rivers Arts Festival. Well, Selena, thank you so much. And it does look like the sun is peeking out there. Is it nice outside? Oh, Heather, it's absolutely beautiful. I know you and I were talking this morning, and it was a chilly start it when was. we woke up. It feels <laughs> great right now. Oh, good to know. <laughs> okay, well, good day to stop down then. Thank you so much, Selena. And, of course, in addition to the art, there's also great music at the festival, as we've been talking about. Here's a look at the lineup for the week ahead of performances on the Dollar Bank main stage in Point State Park. Tonight at 7.30, Band of Magda plays, followed by the Mendelssohn Choir of Pittsburgh today, uh, of Pittsburgh on Tuesday, rather, singing the works and music of Bob Dylan. Lucas Nelson and Pro the promise of real play on Wednesday. And then on Thursday, Sidewalk Chalk plays the main stage. On Friday, Valier June kicks off the weekend, followed by Ricky Skaggs and Kentucky Thunder on Saturday and it all wraps up on Sunday with the popular group the Mavericks and we'll talk more about the Mavericks in just a bit with Pittsburgh Magazine's Sean Collier. That concert is on his list of five essential things to do in June.